He that finds a wife finds a good thing and obtains favor from the Lord, says the Holy Book. It is in this light that the Alati laws have once again registered another marital stride, this time between the prospective bride, Ulua Tosin Olatilo, the only daughter of Mr. Gbenga Olatilo, the younger brother of Prince Bisi Olatilo. The introduction ceremony between Ulua Tosin Olatilo and Adejinwi began with an obeisance to God Almighty for making it possible to witness such an anticipated event. For Mr. Gbenga Olatilo, it was a double celebration which comprised the celebration of his 60th birthday and the introduction ceremony of his daughter, Ulua Tosin Olatilo, a niece to Prince Bisi Olatilo, the chairman and CEO Biscon Communications. As required in all introduction ceremonies, the Adejinwis, the family of the intended groom, danced into the venue of the event and paid homage to the prospective bride's family, the Olatilos, who received them with all the warmth required. Not too long after, the intended groom stepped into the venue in company of his friends to pay respect to the parents and family members of his bride to be. This they did as they were well received. <laughs> The intending groom also went forth to his parents and family members as tradition demands, as they showed approval for his intentions. Attention shifted to the prospective bride who looked radiant in her attire and was accompanied by her friends as they danced into the arena. Her first port of call was at the feet of her parents and family members who gave their blessings to her wholeheartedly. She's so wonderful. She's been a very lovely daughter. She then made her way to meet with the parents and family members of the intended groom who embraced her and showered prayers on her. 
She later moved majestically to meet her husband. <laughs> The introduction proper was immediately carried out as members of both families took some time out to introduce their families one after another to keep them abreast of their identities. This was first done by the Adejiwins, then followed by the Alati laws. The items presented by the family of the intending groom were then shown to all, ranging from oranges to bananas, pineapples, coconut and lots more. Both families and friends were then told to say words of prayers for the prospective bride and intended groom. The celebrations on that auspicious day was a double delight, being an introduction ceremony and also the 60th birthday celebration of Prince Binga Olati Law. There was an interview session in which family members of the Olati Laws praised the celebrant, extolling his good virtues. We thank God for today. <clears throat> the celebrations we are having today is what we can call double delight. You know, uh, Prince uh, Binga Olati Law is my brother. He's the firstborn of our family, of, uh, of my parents and uh, we are all happy for him today that uh, he's doing the introduction of his only daughter today we are meeting the family of the husband to be and today too is marking his 60th birthday we are grateful to god almighty for preserving his life to this day he has been a big a good brother to all of us he has been a good leader. He has been a shining light in the Latino family. And uh, the daughter bringing the family of the husband to be today is another milestone in the Latino family. My good message for him at 60 is that God will continue to preserve his life. We continue to enrich his pocket, give him good health prosper his family, make him relevant to the family and to the nation, and give him rest of mind for the rest of his life. I thank God for his life, for taking him there and bringing him back, and today he's marking as the daughter's introduction. It's a privilege from the Almighty God. I'm happy for him. I bless God for him, and I bless God for this day. And I say, Lord Jesus, you will continue to be with him. You will grant him more life. He will be in good health and in prosperity in the mighty name of Jesus. And I want to say thank you to his beautiful wife. I'm just noticing her today. Because the last time I didn't see her, but today I'm seeing her. And I'm so happy for the family, the brother and sister that are here. I say thank you to everyone that has come. May the good luck take us to celebrate more in Jesus' name. Thank you. I thank God for your life. And I wish you all the best things in life long life and prosperity and at the end i pray that heaven will open it for you you will make heaven in life because whatever we do when we don't have god when we don't have christ in our life we are just nothing so i thank god for your life and may god continue to elevate us i thank god for everybody that uh, celebrating with us there was an opening prayer to officially kickstart the second phase of the event, Prince Benga Olatilo's 60th birthday celebration. Praises and accolades were shared on the celebrant by his younger brother and daughter. A birthday song was chanted for the celebrant amidst cheers and much love from family members and well wishers.
dates, it looks 50 years. Yeah. And I'm going to tell you exact dates. Yeah. Yeah. We thank God for his life. Happy birthday to you. Prince Bengal Attila gave the vote of thanks while the toast was given by his son-in-law. I wish you the best you wish everybody. I wish you the best for your wife, who is an epitome of a mother. I wish you all the best in life. For he is a jolly good fellow. For he is a jolly good fellow. For he is a jolly good fellow. And so say all of us. Whoop, eep, eep, eep. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you very much, sir. The only thing I could just say is just to thank Father, uh, Almighty Father, for keeping me alive up to today. To glorify at all times. It's been so wonderful. I could still remember vividly some 10 years ago when I did celebrate my 50th together with my daughter when she was 16 then and we are doing the housewarming as at that time. And uh, for God to have given me the glory and honor to be able to celebrate the same 68th this same year, that is 10 years after. Well, what other things can I really, really ask from a father? He's been so merciful and I know that he's, uh, he's still going to grant me more years ahead, Amen. more years to come. I uh, only say thank you very much for everybody that has actually come down here today to participate and probably to partake in my uh, celebrations. And I do pray and uh, pray every day uh, for uh, Father to grant every uh, one of you uh, uh, happiness, long life, and prosperity. I won't be able to say so much. You've been so wonderful, and I appreciate you all. Thank to wrap up the birthday celebration, the cutting of the 60th birthday anniversary cake was carried out as supervised by his son. Yeah, I love the, I love the um, tip he gave me now. But all the same, um, when I say J, you say E. Yeah. One, two, go. J, S, S. Hey, the cake won for me. All the same. Give Daddy a wonderful round of applause, please. The closing prayer was then set to bring the event to an end. Dancing and merriment took over the event as the Alatilos danced to the music played by the DJ. Thank <laughs> you.